Hi everybody, um, welcome back to my channel. I am wanting to do a quick spread in my trash journal. I've only got a few pages left in this thing. Um, the tutorial is from 365 art prompts um, from Art for a Spell. And I wanted to um, work in this journal a little bit today since I do have some time and um, hopefully finish it up. So, um, one of the things that I wanted to do was to use one of these pockets, which is also from 365 Art Prompts, um, made it out of a toilet paper roll. Um, I have a little flip out thing here, so I am going to, because I am running low on glue, to be honest, um, I'm just gonna, like that, okay? Um, the toilet paper roll is sturdy enough that I think that it will, um, stay pretty much in there. And I have this, um, this scrap paper that I have been wiping my brushes off on. And I've got this little vintage looking gal. And I want to, I'm going to be stapling a lot of stuff today that I normally wouldn't. I wouldn't normally staple, like, the lady on here but you know what this is mental health journaling right so she's gonna tuck right in there um haven't decided fully what i'm doing with that i also want to use up some of my sticker collection one of the things that i've realized recently is that i have a lot of clutter i have a lot of like extra supplies that i'm not going to be using as much of and so my goal is to use some of that up so I'm just going to decorate this little pocket here with these feather stickers that I got like ages ago when I first started journaling. Oh my goodness. They're also really hard to get off, which is another reason I would really like to use them up because I think I get mad every time I use them. So kind of the idea behind today's spread is just to um, help to use things that I don't always lay my hands on. I don't always remember that I have. Um, there's also the idea that, um, you know, my daily creative practice is special. It deserves the time that I give it every single day. And so um, even though this is low energy and not exactly all of the favorite things that I like to use. It is still something that is good. I'm gonna make something that will make me smile, that gets me into that flow state. Oh my gosh, these stickers. Let me tell ya. I don't have long fingernails. I'm, I have a lot of anxiety all the time, so I bite my fingernails. And I've been trying to stop, but. Okay, so we've got this little lady right here. And I'm gonna, she's gonna just get tucked in like that. Um, I think that's all I wanna do with that, to be honest. Maybe I'll change my mind. So this is like, see, and I got, um, I wiped off my paintbrush here and I got some paint on me, so I'm just gonna spread it out. And this journal was also, um, I don't know if I said it, but this is also, 365 art prompts, art for a spell. Um, check that out um, from Megan in the Moon, um, especially if you need um, extra inspiration. I've got some scraps here. I'll tear that off, put that down here. The stapler is the, I get really impatient waiting for things, and it's also, I also get really, I get really irritated when I can't get my um, glue to actually adhere to what I want it to, so using the stapler helps in those scenarios. I've got this other little sticker here, put that there. Um, let's see what else do I have. I 
I've got a leftover freebie from Mushy Works for spring, and I'm going to um, put that right here. I know that it's not the beginning of spring, but it kind of feels like we're just getting into the groove of it. So I just don't want to think about it, about this too much. I just want it to be something that uh, flows really easy. Oh my goodness. Okay. I have a lot of stickers for Madoka Magica, but I don't necessarily want to use those at the moment because I don't know I just it doesn't seem like something that I should use right now this beautiful like celestial sticker And one of the things, um, I've got this like religious art here that I can do. Um, let's see if this works. So we have had um, little bouts of sickness hitting our household again. Um, so everything that I have been doing has been like very much, I've been working in my sketchbook still. It has been very much um, like focusing on low energy tasks, on things that I can handle, things that don't overwhelm. Okay, so this is actually a scrap that I cut a heart out of, um, and I think it's kind of cute. And, and it kind of has like a little heart there. I mean, if not, the ink that it's that's on it is pretty, so it works. I want this to be a little bit more sturdy, so I am going to... And seeing the best way that I can add this like holographic paper. It makes it a little bit easier to put into the pocket. I think one thing I'm gonna do, I don't know if this is gonna work. I just make it too small ha 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 there it's a lot more secure now um you know it doesn't have to be like super overly pretty it just needs to be functional and it needs like I like I like the paint going on in the background I like her vintage look and the holographic paper is pretty um these pockets are great I have my family members save these toilet paper rolls and I always have some on hand and obviously we save them in our house too um, and it just makes it 
this is not gonna work. Um, it just makes it nice um, to use. It helps me feel just a little bit more sustainable. Um, I've got another sticker here that I am going to put in for right here. It's a little hard to see, but that's okay. Um, and I have this card about EFT tapping that I got a long time ago. And I want to put it on here because tapping is a method that has worked with me for my anxiety. So I'm just gonna put that right there. It's a nice little reminder of something that works when other things are not working. I'm gonna add some scribbles over here. I spent the morning working in my grimoire and so, um, and working on some paintings. I've been spending my days, like especially with the kids being homesick, I've been spending my days working in my sketchbook because that's what's easy to have out in the play area. And so it feels good just to make something just because. And um, I apologize for my scratchy voice. Um, my allergies are pretty much gonna be going bananas until about July, so. Um, Maybe if I color this in, this will I don't know. I'm pretty happy with this. Like I said, it's my trash journal. I've got a lot of scraps in here. I've got some stickers that I don't always reach for. It's helping me use up material um, that I wouldn't necessarily use anywhere else. Um, and it gets me creating. So um you know, there are no rules. We don't have to make things like, and see, I think that turned out okay. We don't always have to make things that are like super aesthetic and super, I don't even know the word. I'm also very tired. So um, there we go. We've got a little pocket on the fold out here. I've got my tapping card here, which is just a nice little reminder card. And I am almost ready to finish up the last couple pages of this journal. Uh, thanks for coming along with this journaling spread. Look at how chunky that is. It is just going to be so much fun to do a flip through with you guys. I hope you have a wonderful day. Okay, bye.